you know, it appears to me, Mr. Kaira, that this is, uh, you know, compete with each other and picking up Kashmir weak in Pakistan. You know, any politician, any political party competing with each other, I'll raise Kashmir first. But, you know, that hysterical hoarse voice of Bilawal out there. And also, what is most ironical, it's not even, he's reading out from some piece of paper that is under him. He's preparing almost like a stage actor. It's not a convincing performance, Mr. Kaira. Why is, why is Bilawal doing this? He's making a, you know, a specimen of himself, if I may say so, by doing this. If you have completed your question, Mr. Bilawal said what our party position is. It's not a new thing. It is our stated position right from our founder president, uh, chairman, Mr. Zulufkar Ali Bhutto. Our brave daughter, Shahid Bhutrama Benazir Bhutto, yeah. and even are now, now. So uh, now you should realize uh, the futility of it, Mr. Kaira. It's enough time for you. For you, you, you should realize the no, futility of Kashmir, it. Kashmir, you have. We, please let me let me put my my version. You have a narrative uh, from Indian side. You have another narrative. We in Pakistan, we have we have something else. We have another narrative. And the Kashmiri leadership and the people of Kashmir, they have their so, own. But you know, uh, the whole world has rejected can, the so called please, narrative please of yours. Me, please don't interrupt me. The United please, Nations please, has rejected please. it. The United States has rejected it. Nobody United in the world Nations takes never rejected it. on it. Gentlemen, if so you have a question and then please be continue. patient, then please be patient to listen my my version. Yes, I'm hearing your version. Be open, be open for debate here. It's not going to be one way traffic. You, but you are not letting me to speak. Is it okay now? You paused. I didn't. You are you are allowed to speak. Please continue, Mr. Kaira. Yes, thank you. Please, I have I, I have I have heard your voice, but there is a there is a narrative on the Indian side. You say that Kashmir is our integral part. Yes. On Pakistan side, we say that there is a promise by the United Nations, by the Indian leadership, to the people of Kashmir, that they will be given right of plebiscite, they will be right, given right of the, the oh self God, you know, you have been told so again and right, again, you've been told again and again about this. You know what happened I in don't the Shimla need, agreement. I don't need to be told again and again by you. You have, you have, I am, you know, I am, it's a lost I am cause given a lesson by the history. No, no, Mr. Kaira, sorry to make okay. it, make a point. You have, it's a, I, I'll make a point clearly. I am you know, sorry, I hear you, heard no you, way, you hear me, Mr. Kaira. Gentlemen, Mr. Mr. Gentlemen, Mr. Mr. Kaira, you are, you are, you are, uh, Mr. Kaira, you are putting listen. some questions to me. Please Mr. put question. Yeah, don't give me a lesson. Don't worry, Mr. Kaira. It's not. I'll give you a lesson if required because this is you not have fought, way forward, gentlemen. Because you have fought wars with India. You have lost every war. You, yes, we, we you have, have been not wars, just have you. Wars you've wars been India. humiliated every time. You realize that. So and and therefore and and point, if, nobody if, in the global if, community uh, takes you seriously. The UN Security Council has not I'm, debated this since 1962. Gentlemen, thank you very much. I am not here to listen to your sermons. I'm very sorry because an anchor has to put questions on me and get my version. You may agree. Well, you may your disagree, point of you don't seem to be no convinced by what you have to say. You obviously I'm want sorry. to run away from the program. I'm sorry. I, you because have not you don't want me. to counter me. If you can counter me, counter me factually Gentlemen, now. You, 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 Counter me factually. Is it, is it a way? Is Counter it a me way? factually, is it Mr. Kaira. Counter me. You have called me over here. Please listen me now. You have called me, invited me in your, your studio. You put your question and then be patient. If you cannot, if you are not patient and you don't have the capacity to learn, to listen from others, yeah, and a different point of view, please don't call us. Mr. Kaira, not I've asked you to the come question, to but you to, seem to, to be no, having no I'm answer sorry. tonight. I've told you and you counter me now. I'm you are not you. letting me to answer. You're not le letting me to answer. So I'll ask you Don't a question after that like you this. answer. So my Thank question is much. simple. Thank you very much. You are insulting me now. Well, Mr. Kaira, if you choose to run away from my program, that's not my problem. I'm not running away from pro your program. Put your question and then wait. All right. Don't get angry. Here's my, my question. Let me, let me give my answer. Here's my question. Don't, okay, here's my question. I'll ask the question and then I'll wait and you reply. And my question to you question? tonight, you Mr. Kaira, is this. And everyone's watching you. Have you, to get, you, you have a sermon to get. You have a sermon for me. My question. No, I'm not question. sermons. If I if I'm putting uncomfortable facts, I'm sorry. But you know these are uncomfortable facts. And I'm just putting a question. This is no way. Well, I am all. quite amazed that you are you are you are you are questioning me like this. I am quite amazed that you expect me to toe the Pakistani line. My question is simply this. You no, have no, not all of Pakistani line, but be patient. Yeah, Let, one second. Listen, Pakistani That's line. Right. I am listening your line. So, Mr. Kaira, my question to you. Thank you very much. My Thank you very much. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. Well, if this you choose no to way. run away, it's not my problem, Mr. Kaira. 
And I don't understand why you're so touchy about it. The representative of the PPP just ran away. Ran away, Mr. Tariq Pirzada, when asked the questions, that's what happens. Because it's proven here that Bilawal Bhutto well, is acting uh, as like Do you want my state. answer? Well, you know, if you have an answer, unless you also choose to run away tonight, that empty yes, chair I is do. proof of the fact yes, I, that yes, when I faced do. with let tough me, let questions, me make you the run Pakistanis away. have no real answers tonight, Mr. Pirzada. Let Pizzada, me, let me yes. make you run away. That's all right, yeah, Mr. Let me just, all right, listen. Uh, first of all, enough Pakistanis you have done this people before. from India who lie on the issue of Kashmir. We had Casey Singh this afternoon and he lied about the, uh, you know, wording of the resolution which says the withdrawal of Indian forces from Kashmir. And uh, he said, no, the word is that of reduction. And I countered him. He did not agree. I checked it. He lied to, uh, to 1.3 billion people of India. The Indian forces will have to withdraw in case of plebiscite. Uh, under the supervision of the uh, you know, commissioner you appointed by the United Nations. That's number one. Number two, you, you guys finished? are so scared. Uh, you guys are so scared of the speech of Prime Minister of Pakistan that will be delivered at the United Nations that you are trying Nobody to create uh, the Nobody very even momentum cares. of Pakistan Nobody cares. for the Kashmir we by, st by coming up with this uh, very silly one-sided show. See then that is a sad commentary on your class. I, I, I ask our viewers on the news are tonight to just do one thing. You know why the PPP representative ran away from news are? You go back and you see a 1989 well, video. Not, no, I tell you. You did not run away. You sir, did not just ran let away. him talk. You did not. My way, look, the reason I talk on your show is because I forced my way into the show. <laughs> you don't let me talk. You know something, he, he's sir. A, he's Sometimes, a different kind of... So he, there are, he's a different person. Sir, the, and he has uh, different Mr. Ways. Mr. Pizada, Mr. Pizada, don't force yourself. I just say, I have something to say to the viewers. I'm talking to them now. There is a 1989 video of Benazir Bhutto where she works herself uh, up into loud, a frenzy. Please. You know, on Kashmir. Bilawal Bhutto is copying her, trying to copy her actions. His voice goes hoarse like her voice goes hoarse. Only in his case, he begins to look down at a piece of paper. There is neither conviction nor passion in that voice. Maruf and Mahesh Jetpalani, to, to you, Mr. Jetpalani, first of all, it appears to me this is raise Kashmir week because they know Nawaz Sharif will raise it, you know, in, in the UN. So the PPP better raise it now and then Imran Khan and will probably so raise it. That. That. Same old predictable, so boring, broken of record you script of Pakistan is going to play out. Yes, Mr. Jetpalani. Yes, Mr. Jetpalani, what do you think? But, you know, uh, Arnav, I, I wish the spokesperson of the PPP hadn't gone away because I had a very important question to ask him. Look, it's par for the course now for, for spokespersons and leaders of that all Pakistani of political parties. On your part. Sir, don't, you sir, it's straightforward, sir, it's straightforward. I don't need certificates from Pakistanis on our journey, sir. Yeah. To, to raise to raise the Kashmir bogey time and uh, time and again, uh, Bilawal has obviously done it because a it's a family legacy, b his party has been marginalised in the last election, and c this is competitive politics and Kashmir is the only issue which they can now bandy about and compete with each other. So they are out Kashmiring each he other. Raised but many the real issues. question is that was the, one of them. Be, be, behind Mr. Mr. Pizada, you were not interrupted. Please. I, I request you to be a gentleman and hear me out because, because this question is not addressed to you. You are misrepresenting this, how Mr. Balawal presented I, the case of Kashmir. That was one of the issues in that speech that so he, he made. He didn't misrepresent. He made the only no, issue. No, he no, made, he did, but you know... Uh, so he, rep, he made a specimen of himself. Uh, what did I you know, say? Uh, yeah, he made a, the, the PPP. Mr. Pizada, Mr. Mr. When it comes Pizada, to India and Pakistan, in, Kashmir is a specific issue it's no specific dispute. sir he made a and let everybody in pakistan will raise it that's, all that's right. a very sensible thing for pakistanis to do arnab arnab mr pizada may have his own narrative the pakistanis may have their own narrative uh, but that narrative has failed uh, from times immemorial now but it the very crucial question that's about a, a aspiring leader like bilawal uh, an aspiring leader like bilawal uh, the, the most crucial question is, is that his party position? Because that's what, that's what the spokesperson who ran away just said, or walked away just said. He said that was, Bilawal was only mouthing his party's official position on Kashmir. Now, if beyond that mouth-frothing rant of Bilawal's, is the real crux of the issue, his statement. Let's analyze his statement. What he says is that he will seize 
every inch of Kashmir and not leave any part of it. Now, now that, is, that is bellicose, that is belligerent, and that is the language of an aggressor. I, I don't think it can be the stated position of his party in its well, manifesto it that Kashmir of an is going to be seized because by, this is the right by, by aggression. It cannot be. In any plebiscite, Kashmir we will are committed come to, us. to One I minute, both countries are committed to the Zilla Agreement. Mr. Pizada, you do not know history and you don't respect, international, you don't respect international law. You are a terrorist exporting nation and, and all you do on television is you spout nonsense. Just do what your former masters have just done. Do follow the British, hold privacy in Kashmir like the British held in You know, Scotland. you know, I, I'll That's tell you where, I'll Kashmir. tell you, Mr. I'll tell you, sir, where we want a plebiscite. We want a plebiscite in Baluchistan. Where between July 2010, we where, where between to July 2010 and January 2011, we, we there are 700, the 700 extra constitutional killings Kashmir. and abductions by paramilitary forces for enforced disappearances, journalists disappear, teachers disappear, political activists disappear, human rights defenders have been targeted, students have not been spared. You have no right to talk about Kashmir anymore. You know, you have no right Arnab, to talk about Arnab, Kashmir Arnab, anymore. I need sir. to give you a little. I'm lesson. telling you, sir. I need to. And give you know why the PPP represents. You know, he ran he, off from the news tonight because, because, because he realized he would be counter. Because he realized he would be counter. And I refuse to let any Pakistani representative that. walk away it without being challenged on this that program. That the government of India and Pakistan have agreed to hold a plebiscite in Kashmir. Oh, you're going on now like a broken record. GV and Narasimha Rao. GV and Narasimha Rao. GV and Narasimha Rao tonight language. on, on this rake up, rake up Kashmir week. You know, Mr. Rao, one point agenda the Pakistanis have. Rake up Kashmir, rake up when you're of insecure, course. rake up Kashmir. And when it comes to India, it when is you, always when, one point When you have agenda. nothing to do, Kashmir, rake up Kashmir. Kashmir when the, when the Kashmir Americans, when Kashmir the Americans, lasts. when the Americans bomb you, rake up Kashmir. When Osama bin Laden is found, rake up Kashmir. Keep when you protect keep, Mullah Omar, rake up Kashmir. Enjoying. When when members that, of the Shia when members of the Shia population are killed in targeted attacks, aggression rake up Kashmir. Pakistan. What did I ever say? That the Chinese beat the hell out of you in oh, 1962. Please, you know. Mar I think GVL Narasimha Rao is going to take you on Mr. Rao, please. I, I, Mr. Rao, please. Mr. Pizada, and have the patience no, to listen. Now, Argue. I, yeah, Mr. Rao. I don't, I, don't think, I don't think we need to take uh, uh, Bilawal's comments, uh, very immature uh, and, and very, very silly comments so seriously because uh, he's proving to be a spoiled dynastic brat from across exactly. the border. I don't think he has any position. He's simply bragging and he's trying to uh, 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 kind of present himself as a future leader. Uh, I don't think he he's himself convinced about what he's saying. India is committed to its uh, parliamentary uh, uh, resolution of 1994, where we say Kashmir is an integral part of India. We want even Pakistan occupied Kashmir. We want that to be uh, 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 taken uh, back, given back yeah. integrity. National nego negotiation. There is no negotiation on in integrity, territorial integrity of India. This is all what a BJP manifesto. You'll be very says. much embarrassed when one day integral part the of same. India. Narendra Modi will be holding to, talks on Kashmir because about, that is the original and the fundamental and position uh, in the of, statement the taken brand, by Modi a uh, day before the election. He said, we will the resolve the issue split. of Kashmir. So that contradicts your very insensible statement. I think if they continue with this kind of this kind of rhetoric, you have, they you have chosen a wrong the, prime minister. They, 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 he talks about Kashmir. They have, they have Arun Jetty, Arun Jetty talks about minister. Kashmir. Shishma, Shishma Suraj talks about Kashmir. You are the only one who is denying don't it. Talk. The whole nation, the whole nation is behind the prime minister. Modi. You you probably need totally to you need to, to shut up your own government. Kashmir Tell them don't India. talk about it. I think and, and then the come on the show and talk to doesn't me. Doesn't even have the authority. Doesn't even have the authority. You are a failed state. We have, we have how we have handled floods on the on on in Kashmir, Jammu and Kashmir. How you have failed to provide even relief to the Kashmir people of Pakistan. Kashmir will be Kashmir. coming to Pakistan yes, sir, once. I, I, I think I think this is really held on this issue. Sir, you under make the me. Sir, I feel sorry. I feel I I, I, I genuinely feel sorry.
I, I, I genuinely feel I genuinely feel sorry for the you people of Pakistan. Feel. You I feel, I feel, feel I feel I sorry. Read your face. I feel sorry, and I say this to you on your I face. You can walk off the program too if you want. Taken in I, show I feel sorry for the people of, of you Pakistan guys are hawks that they are being trying maroof. to bully your own government. Sir, one second, sir. You know what? It's a human rights watch report. So you know what? If you can only argue on fact, please do that with me. You know. You are being told by the Pakistani government is being told by everyone. Please stop the killing of Shia Muslims in Baluchistan. In 2012, well, 325, 000, have, 325 members of the Shia Muslim population up, have been killed in targeted up, attacks that took second. place all over Pakistan. You want me I to tell you what just, happened on August 6th? Just left. Thousands of Kashmiris buried in the mudslides in these recent floods. You know something. What are you Even Pakistanis about have been rescued Tell by our army. You should, you should keep shut up. To read a little more that. about Kashmir. Sir, you know what? You know, Mr. Pirzada, if only you can learn the skill of arguing here with rational fact, not with this. Oh, you know, don't talk you like. I'm sorry to tell you this, Mr. Pirzada, but but don't talk like clay. Bilawal Bhutto. Oh, I love you for news. that. Are Don't talk like Bilawal Bhutto on the news. I think Bilawal Bhutto has become I an am example. I am of your nonsense. You well, anyway, that. sir, the Human Rights Commission of Pakistan says that... that you know what you do? That what? is the worst form of embedded Maruf. journalism, uh, you know, fueled in your mind yeah. by raw and by other agencies. Sir, I really India. think you are that losing the, the plot now. That is the worst thing I've seen. I think... I think... <laughs> oh! Don't be angry. Maru, Maru nice brother, <laughs> tonight a PPP spokesperson walks don't off and I think nice Mr. Pirzada doesn't have enough facts to back him up anymore. Ma Maruf, Maruf, so in, in this, in this whole, in we this, are raising this issue and the United Nations, no matter what you do or what you say on this show, water of a duck's back, sir, Maruf. Orna, Orna, I've been hearing Maruf is not quite, alive. quite a degree of amusement for the last thirty minutes. Yes. Uh, uh, all the stuff that is being exchanged. Oh, how can a comedian sort of talk about a museum as uh, a museum from the Bhutto, other side? Bilawal Bhutto is like Maruf Raza. Oh God, oh Mr. Pizada, Mr. Pizada, come on, Mr. come on, Pizada, Maruf Raza, don't try to sound out. serious. I'm often asked you by. You have never been I'm serious asked, in your life. You have been Mr. Pizada, facts for the last Mr. two Pizada, years on this show. Mr. Pizada, hear me out. Mr. Pizada. You cannot be honest on this issue at all. M Mr. Pizada, Mr. Pizada, you've often been routed by the facts that we put across, but you rant on and on, and people in India ask me that why do I let go of decorum and ask no, you no, to no. shut up? People in India I ask, ask you to do that you because that you're such a pain. I don't yourself, know. I don't know wrong. why. Even, even, show, Pakistani, so even Pakistani is right to me. Now, will you hear me out? So blindly, Mr. Pizada, will you hear me out? Kashmir, Mr. Pizada, the resolutions Mr. Ornab, Ornab, I suggest, Come on. I suggest you bring down the volume of oh, Mr. Pizada so that you allow us to serious. speak. Or don't get us on the show with Pizada. Right. He's and an I, well, you know, I, I request you, Mr. Pizada, you can have all the strong views that you have. But if you think that, you know, constantly you talking can, about Maruf will quietly, strengthen your case, I wrong. sat quietly for half an Let hour. Let him speak. He and has listened to you. Doesn't, he did not even interrupt. Oh, he did speak. not even interrupt when the PPP spokesperson either or not. You, you just bring Pizada. You just bring Pizada. You let him complete his point and let us all be. Mr. Pizada, I request you to keep quiet. Reduce the volume. Because please, he's sir. not letting anybody right, else speak. Right, I'm, sir, I'm please let him complete right his ahead. point. Please reduce his volume. You let him complete let his point. I, I will if I have to. Please let him you're, complete you're his point. Like Mr. Pizza, the verbal the heckling, facts, verbal heckling is, is no great quality on the news. Now Mr. Maruf can complete. No, Maruf can complete. Now Mr. Pizza, please I request you. Mr. Pizza, people across India want to hear what Maruf has to say on this. Yeah, please. Go ahead now. I respect you, Arnav. Go ahead. I just want to say... I'm not, I am not, I'm not countering Mr. Pizada's narrative. All that I'm saying is, Zo B Bilawal Bhutto is turning 26. He is now able to enter the National Assembly because he is of the voting age. There is nothing better than Kashmir to rig up sentiments in Pakistan, especially if you want to get into the political game. But please understand that Bilawal Bhutto counts for virtually nothing in Pakistan's political landscape today. 
And if this kind of a remark and rhetoric had come from a former military commander or a former prime minister, I would still take it seriously. I don't see the reason why we are taking Bilawal Bhutto's ranting seriously. Theatricals is part of his family legacy in as much as those who defend his family legacy by saying that they are emotionally attached to Kashmir. The Bhuttos are Sindhis and Jhulfikar Bhutto's mother was from a family near Jodhpur. But anyway, let that be. As far as I'm concerned, Zulfikar Bhutto signed on the Shimla agreement and agreed that hereafter we will resolve issues bilaterally through dialogue. Benazir Bhutto also wants a dialogue and bilateral relations to go part. forward. That's a so where is, part where is Bilawal getting his stuff from? Agreement. That is what is perplexing. As far no, as Pakistan is concerned, years since. Pakistan can go on and on about UN and UN resolution. But Mr. Pizada and others would then do why well are to you know guys so that nobody in the world it? gives a why damn about so their sentiment about and the attachment. Because we are just about to call your bluff. As far as India is concerned, because, because as far as Mr. Why Modi is concerned, so my guess is, Nawashiri my guess is, my guess is that Mr. Modi will ignore you. And the speech of Nawaz Sharif. Modi will not ignore you. We will ignore you, Modi, Mr. Peace. We might Adha, ignore you, sir. You count for nothing. You. I bet, you don't I count bet. for anything Me anymore, you Mr. Peace. You are inconsequential. Issue issue because it is you a are a stepping stone so for the Americans in Afghanistan. You have the lost American your relevance, Mr. Peace. Peace you will be left to defend yourself. You have lost your relevance. You are irrelevant. I think a very critical moment emerges in the history of Pakistan. If my we were irrelevant, you wouldn't be having me on this on this show. So we are we have called you to say how irrelevant you become. And, and Mr. You are there for no, theatrical value. Mr. Pizza, that you are there for theatrical value. Listen, just sir, like the, the whole please world understand, sir, everyone around the world is saying tonight. Take a position. Everyone you across the world, when you know, I'll tell you, look at any rational debate, look at the think tanks, look at the people who matter, look at the people who create policy. Mr. Pizza, listen to me. Listen to me, please. Kashmir stands with you. India and I've India stands with Kashmir. In 1954, the Jammu and Kashmir Constituent Assembly has ratified the state's accession to India. In 1956, the, of the Jammu and Kashmir and Constituent Assembly Pakistan has adopted a resolution. Effectively. Now That's you don't want to listen. Shouting, and the whole crowd that you have is shouting on this issue tonight. So, Mr. You guys Pizza, know the agony that comes to you, you know, from you, our, uh, from us raising the issue of Kashmir. You know, you, you don't, I'll tell you what, you're so unfair to the people. We certainly get irritated by your behavior, you, Mr. You know, Pizza, let me, let me, Mr. I think Maru, Maru, I want to just put two or three things on the table. You know, I would have, I would have, I would have, I would have put on. it, I would have put it to the I'm people. I'm not going to run away. I'm not going to leave the show. I'm here. Yeah, and so I'm here until the last minute. Yeah. Kashmir don't, is a real don't. issue for, of you, real you, people. You and it Mr. belongs to Pakistan. I think this is the... That's my opinion. That's my position. Mr. Jaj Malani, I think we should... You know, in Pakistan this week, Mr. Jaj Malani and Mr. Rao... And Mr. Pizza, just calm down. No problem. Please, you know. Fine. You okay. see, it's all right. So, okay. you know, I don't know. Are you joining the PPP that you're jumping up for Bilal? Well, you're not. No, so calm down. The question here is, the question here <laughs> I'm, is I'm that... I'm going to join the question here is, uh, Mr. 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 Jait Palani, it is clear from the discussion in Pakistan that this entire week will be, you know, let's pick up Kashmir week. I think we can potentially and at the UNGA so much, and elsewhere. One minute, sir. Actually, you are so much wrong. You are so much wrong. In Pakistan right now, I feel Kashmir, so sorry. There are so many other issues in addition to Kashmir. I know there so are. Can actually, I'll tell you five you issues? You are misleading. I'll tell Mr. you five Jet, issues. Jet Milani. I'll tell. I know there are many issues. I'll tell you. I'll tell you, you are five. giving him now, Mr. Pizza. Mr. Pizza, just is one listen. One of the issues at the present. Yeah, I'll time. tell you. I'll tell you. There are five issues. I am aware there are many issues. You in are Pakistan. not reading Pakistan's political scene I am very telling accurately. You, sir, at the I am telling time. you, sir. Uh, the number of thousands yes, of sir. thousands of women being persecuted as per the Human Rights Commission in Pakistan is a big issue. Yeah, I agree with you. Your top journalist, the there is an attempt children, by the ISI women, to, there was an the attempt by the ISI to kill Hamid Meer. That, that is a big issue. 
Yeah, Baluchistan, Baluchistan has gone out of control. That is a big issue. There are number of targeted killings, targeted killings of Shias in across Pakistan by by Sunni extremist groups. That is a very big issue. And and people of all religious minorities have been persecuted in Pakistan to the point to which a poor Hindu community had been facing eviction from an area in Rawalpindi where its members lived for almost 80 years. These are very big issues. And and and. And 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 Mr. Mr. Pizada and Mr. Pizada, I my question to Mr. Jaitmalani is, and I'm actually reducing your volume now. Mr. Jaitmalani, how do we how do we marginalize the Pakistanis this week? How do we marginalize the Pakistanis this week? We need to. And the expectation is that we will do. How do we do it now? Arnab, I honestly think that uh, Bilawal and every Pakistani who talks about Kashmir is just uh, is just indulging in an unnecessary rant. I think we are we are over uh, uh, becoming a little over sensitive to the uh, the only the only uh, irritant as far as uh, Bilawal is concerned is that he threatened to take Kashmir back by force. That was implicit in his statement, uh, not by dialogue or any such thing. They may have a different narrative, as I said, but I think we should ignore it. I I'm not even sure whether whether uh, this was because uh, of any Why impending belief on the part of uh, Bilawal and the PPP that. Uh, uh, Nawaz Sharif, Nawaz Sharif is going to make a statement on the 26th uh, before the UN on Kashmir. I'm not even sure. I just think that this is this is a reaction to the PPP being completely marginalised, and, and, and not only are they no longer a ruling party force, but even in opposition, the main force now is, is uh, Imran Khan's party. So, so I think basically this is just a this is just a very dramatic and very unfortunate attempt. I trying to get political attention but it's time to it's also mr rao it's time to time to demolish this k card i feel this is the time i mean we can't be yeah. too generous or too patient with the pakistanis anymore maybe we can also show some muscle in new york oh please do so no i think the uh, uh, sure? prime minister had sent out prime minister modi had sent out a very clear signal uh, only a month ago that this kind of uh, the Pakistan's attempt to internationalize or to involve third parties will not be tolerated. I think the message to Pakistan is very loud and clear and it has a lot of problems, internal problems. It is actually imploding. Pakistan as a country is imploding. I think the Kashmir is used, only used as an issue to somehow keep uh, their political relevance, political, he actually Bilawal is fighting the political irrelevance of the PPP. And I think the Pakistan, if you look at the past six decades, I think today they are at their weakest point to raise the issue of, of Kashmir. So I, I think we need not be unju unduly perturbed about it. I think it is Pakistan where I think it, which is facing the facing the heat, Absolutely. facing the pressure, and it is not in a position to really create any trouble and for the way, India. And I think the, it's best to ignore Pakistan. And the way you moment. are breaking up, sir, you should be more careful that the next time at the United Nations, you are represented as one country, not by Baluchistan, NWFP, Sindh or pa Punjab. These are realities. Please prepare yourself. Keep your country together. Best of luck and tell Bilawal, tell Bilawal to go to a proper acting class. Yes, Mahesh Edman, I tell Bilawal to go to a proper acting class. Yes, there are quite a few in Mumbai. He can enroll himself in an yes, acting class yes, if he one, wants to put up a performance yes, the next time. Yes, Mahesh Jetpalani. Really poor show he just put up. One message to Mr. Bila just one message to Mr. Bilawal Bhutto. And that is that if he tries or Pakistan tries any misadventure as they have on the last four occasions, Far from them leaving any inch behind of Kashmir, there will be no inch left of Pakistan. We will finish what we should have done to Western Pakistan in 1971. That, Mr. Bilawal Bhutto, you should realize and get that message loud and clear in your head. I think the point is well taken. I thank you all, including the PPP representative who ran away 20 minutes back for joining me on this debate on the news tonight.